Hi friends, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to talk about a subject that has been on my mind for a while. Um, Booktube is a place where you can make some friends and they're true friendships a lot of the times. You can't have just casual internet, you know, acquaintances, but there are times where you develop deep connections and that a lot of times is when buddy reads start to happen. And I'm going to talk about that in context of reading through challenging times in our life. I remember a time in about 2014, and it lasted for quite a while, where um, it was just a super, super challenging time in my life. I was um, at the hospital a lot with one of my children, um, and it was just chaos. And I stopped reading everything but the Bible. Thank God I continued to read that because it fed me spiritually. And I read what I needed to gain information. But pleasure reading and fiction that I adored and would get excited about kind of fell off for me. And I did not keep that as an integral part of my life. It didn't only affect reading, it affected other things too that I enjoyed. So um, I finally got it back, thankfully, and I joined BookTube in... Um, spring of 2021. No, that's not right. Spring of 2022. <laughs> I'm trying to make myself having been on here longer. I was watching other people's videos at that point in time, but I wasn't a member of the community myself. Wasn't even really commenting in 2021. So in April of 2022, I joined the booktube community and I found like-minded people pretty quickly. Um, and that led to what we call buddy reads. That's when you read with someone else and you may or may not be on the same page with them or not with the book. But a lot of times, even if you disagree, you're, um, creating deeper connections and it brings the enjoyment of the reading experience to an even more deep connected point. So, um, August of 2023 was another, you know, emergency, severe, life-altering time in my life. And, um, I had two buddy reads planned in that month. And of course, who I was reading with, one of them was Courtney Reads, the other one was Bethany from Bethany Brings Books. We're like, we don't have to do this. Um... But I decided that I wanted to try things differently this time. And I knew I didn't have much time for reading. And I knew that um, it was going to be hard. But I decided to try to keep these buddy reads. One of them was Brothers Karamazov with Courtney. And the other one was Flight of the Falcon with Bethany. And what I found is that helped me be more connected to what was my normal life. Um, a few months later, I did a buddy read, started with Beautiful Minutia as well, but, um, it ended up being mainly with, um, my friend Dia from Novel Idea. We did, um, Nicholas Nickleby together. And sometimes just reading with people and Dia always brings me such spiritual, deep wisdom and Courtney always helps me to be just more aware of the world around me. And Bethany, she always kind of reminds me just in who she is to be grateful. And um, I did a buddy read with Chrissy's Purple Library and um all these uh, late, we did read Jamaica Inn, which isn't a necessarily a common book, but it was very distracting from what was going on health-wise in our family. And what was amazing is all these people were people that were praying for me. Um, 
and they cared about me. So my thought to you all today is try not to throw out your reading completely. And if you have flexible buddy readers, try to continue to read if you can. Um, because sometimes this can just really help. I did fun middle grade buddy read with the Donya Silver Scribe, Chatty the Mad Chatter, and Bandana Book Mom. And just reading something fun just takes you out of your circumstances and just can bring joy and it can be a blessing from above to continue on with your friends. Um, but if that's not going to help you in your time, don't listen to it, my advice. But if you think it at all could help, you might try it out. All right, I hope you read a lot. This was just a very random video, but I thought I would put it out there in case that helps someone. All right, bye friends.